larger scale. Do we have any more facts regarding what actually caused these blackouts or who's behind it? It seems like we're just in a blame game right now. Well, Maduro has said that he's certain that the United States uh, ordered it, that it was a direct attack, um, that it was even uh, carried out from Houston and Chicago at the orders of the Pentagon Southern Command in Miami, Florida. Um, he's ordered a special investigation and asked the United Nations, as well as uh, Venezuela's allies in China, Russia, Iran, and Cuba, to take part in, uh, in the investigation. And Venezuela's attorney general um, is uh, investigating Juan Guaido for allegedly sabotaging the power grid. Now, the U.S. has, of course, uh, denied any involvement, but the New York Times has reported that U.S. sanctions are at least partially responsible for the outages. Uh, now, their report says, quote, the sanctions have affected Venezuela's ability to import and produce the fuel required by the thermal power plants that could have backed up the Guri plant once it failed. Um, now, that seems to be the only factual reporting that I've seen from either side coming out that actually has something to back it up besides just politicians lobbing rockets at each other with this. Exactly. So nothing is proven, but we do know, according to the New York Times, at least the U.S. sanctions are at least partially responsible. But one of the most fascinating uh, aspects of what I've found in my research is from um, a document that WikiLeaks released. And this is an email from 2010 sent um, by this group Canvas, which is a Serbian anti-communist kind of regime change training group that uh, has taken substantial amounts of money from the U.S. government and actually trained many members of Juan Guaido's popular will party. And this document, as I said, is from 2010 when Chavez was in power, and it lays out how a collapse in Venezuela's uh, electrical system could be used to overthrow the government. Basically, this group Canvas in this email said a collapse of the electrical system would be a watershed event that would galvanize public unrest and an opposition group could take advantage of the situation to spin it against Chavez and towards its own needs. So it's a very it's revealing document. Very revealing document. But going, like your lights going out in your community is definitely scary. I couldn't imagine an entire country having to suffer for it. So obviously people want questions. Now